Every atom is a universe, a tiny cathedral of energy where electrons dance, protons pulse with force, and quantum fields weave the very fabric of reality. From the hydrogen in your blood to the gold in your ring, every atom obeys a set of laws so strange, so beautiful, that they defy classical reason. This is not chemistry, this is quantum mechanics, the hidden architecture of matter itself. Before we get too deep into this topic, be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel. This helps to bring more valuable content to the platform for your knowledge and understanding. Remember, knowledge is power. Now back to the episode. The story of the atom begins not in laboratories, but in philosophy. Two and a half thousand years ago, the Greek thinker Democritus proposed that all things are composed of indivisible units, atomos. But for centuries, that was only an idea. Then came the age of experiment. In the early 1900s, Ernest Rutherford fired alpha particles through gold foil and discovered that atoms were mostly empty space, with a dense nucleus at their core. And soon after, Niels Bohr proposed his planetary model, electrons orbiting the nucleus in neat quantized shells. It was revolutionary, but incomplete. Because reality, it turned out, was not neat. In 1900, Max Planck shattered physics by showing that energy is quantized, emitted in discrete packets called quanta. And in 1905, Albert Einstein explained the photoelectric effect, that light itself behaves like a particle, a photon. Soon, Louis de Broglie proposed that matter too, like light, has wave properties. This wave-particle duality formed the cornerstone of quantum mechanics. The atom was no longer a miniature solar system. It was a cloud of probability, where particles could exist in many states at once, until measured. This shift, from deterministic certainty to quantum indeterminacy, transformed our understanding of everything from chemistry to cosmology. In 1926, Erwin Schrödinger wrote an equation that would forever define the atom's inner life. It wasn't just a formula, it was a map of possibility. The Schrödinger equation describes how a quantum system evolves in time, giving rise to the wave function, a mathematical field of probabilities describing where a particle might be found. In simple terms, an electron isn't here or there until you look. Before observation, it exists in a superposition a blend of all possible locations. And when you measure it, the wave function collapses, revealing a single outcome. This is the mystery at the heart of the atom. Reality doesn't exist definitively until it's observed. Forget the classical orbits of Bohr's model. Quantum mechanics reveals a richer structure. Orbitals, regions where electrons are most likely to be found. Each orbital, S, P, D, and F, describes a unique shape, from spheres to lobes to intricate patterns that defy intuition. These quantum states determine the atom's chemistry, why oxygen binds with hydrogen, why iron conducts, and why gold shines the way it does. At this level, probability becomes geometry. The elegance of the periodic table, the predictability of elements, emerges not from chance, but from quantum order. Recent studies in ultrafast electron microscopy, University of Göttingen, 2019, have even visualized these orbitals in real time, confirming what Schrödinger's math had only predicted nearly a century earlier. Enter Werner Heisenberg. His uncertainty principle tells us that we can never know both the exact position and momentum of a particle simultaneously. The more precisely we measure one, the less precisely we know the other. This isn't a limitation of technology. It's a feature of nature itself. Within the atom, this means that electrons do not orbit in fixed paths, but exist as waves of probability. Reality at this scale is not deterministic. It's fundamentally probabilistic. Even today, experiments at CERN and quantum optics labs worldwide confirm this uncertainty. It's not that the world is fuzzy. It's that certainty itself is an illusion. In the quantum world, barriers are not absolute. 
particles can tunnel through obstacles they classically shouldn't cross, appearing on the other side as if by magic. This phenomenon, known as quantum tunneling, is not theoretical. It powers the sun's nuclear fusion, allows radioactive decay, and forms the basis of technologies like the scanning tunneling microscope and quantum diodes. In 2020, researchers at the University of Rochester timed the tunneling process, finding that electrons can cross barriers in less than a trillionth of a second. To the quantum atom, barriers are suggestions, not walls. But perhaps the most astonishing property of quantum atoms is entanglement. When two particles become entangled, their states are linked, no matter how far apart they are. Measure one, and the other reacts instantly. Einstein called it spooky action at a distance. Modern experiments, from Alain Aspect's 2022 Nobel-winning work to recent photon tests at MIT, confirm that entanglement is real, not illusion. It reveals a deeper truth. Atoms are not isolated units. They are nodes in a web of instantaneous connectivity, a quantum fabric that spans the cosmos. Within you, Every atom is whispering in harmony with the universe. The atom, as it turns out, is not made of solid particles at all. What we call particles, electrons, protons, neutrons, are excitations in underlying quantum fields. The standard model of particle physics describes 17 fundamental fields, from the electromagnetic to the Higgs field, each vibrating to create the illusion of matter. In this view, the atom is not a thing. It's a pattern in a field of energy. You, me, and the stars are quantum resonances in motion. Recent experiments at Fermilab and CERN probe these fields with unprecedented precision, revealing that even the vacuum, what we call empty space, is alive with quantum fluctuations. Today, we are harnessing these atomic secrets in ways the early pioneers could only imagine. Quantum computers manipulate qubits, atoms and photons in superposition, to perform calculations billions of times faster than classical machines. Quantum sensors measure biological signals at the cellular level, leading to breakthroughs in brain imaging and regenerative medicine. At MIT and Stanford, researchers are developing quantum simulators to model molecular behavior a step that could revolutionize drug design and disease treatment. We are learning to speak the language of atoms, to program matter itself. The deeper we look into the atom, the more we discover that we are not separate from the universe. We are expressions of it. Every breath, every heartbeat, every spark of thought arises from a sea of quantum motion. Atoms are not mere building blocks. They are the living pulse of reality, dancing to the symphony of the quantum world. This is the quantum mechanics of atoms, where the universe within mirrors the universe beyond. If you found this content helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about the subatomic world, where particles play by their own rules. Join me next time for another deep dive into the strange and unusual world of quantum physics.